Tetracyclines are a broad-spectrum class of antibiotics, effective against a wide range of bacteria, including both gram-positive and gram-negative organisms. They work by inhibiting bacterial protein synthesis, thereby halting bacterial growth and replication. In this video, we will discuss about some important clinical pharmacology pearls about these tetracyclines. So let's get started. Photosensitivity. Tetracyclines, particularly doxycycline and minocycline, can cause photosensitivity reactions. Patients should be advised to avoid excessive sun exposure and use sunscreen to prevent sunburn. Avoid dairy products. To prevent interaction with calcium, tetracyclines should be taken on an empty stomach and patients should avoid dairy products or calcium supplements close to dosing times. Tooth discoloration. Long-term use of tetracyclines can cause tooth discoloration in children. They should be avoided in children under 8 years of age and during pregnancy to prevent this side effect. Drug resistance. Overuse or inappropriate use of tetracyclines can lead to the development of bacterial resistance. They should be used judiciously and only for infections where they are proven to be effective. Alternative dosing for renal impairment. For patients with renal impairment, dosage adjustments are essential to avoid potential toxicity. Doxycycline is often preferred in such cases due to its minimal renal excretion. In summary, tetracyclines are a versatile class of antibiotics with a broad spectrum of activity, particularly useful in treating infections caused by atypical pathogens and certain STDs. Despite their efficacy, they are associated with several side effects and contraindications, particularly concerning children, pregnant women, and individuals with renal impairment. Proper patient counseling and adherence to dosing guidelines can help mitigate potential risks and enhance therapeutic outcomes. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, let us know in the comments below which drug class you'd like to see Clinical Pearls on next. Keep learning, keep growing, and see you next time. Thank you.